Good afternoon, Mr. Young here. So I want to do a short lesson on percents, fractions, and decimals and how they're related. Now I predominantly work with Navajo students. I find a lot of the times uh, we're trying to make that connection with the mathematics. So what better way to do this uh, culturally with my Navajo students? Let's say we have the decimal, let's say uh, 9 tenths. That would be equivalent as a fraction to 9 tenths and that would be equivalent to 90%. Okay, now what is the relation between these culturally? All right, so the method I use was that we have multiplication and division. So we know that multiplication and division are both inverse operations to each other. Now imagine that multiplication would be like, let's say, you know, let's say they fell in love, <laughs> all right? It's kind of goofy, but just, just hear me out. So they fell in love, and we have the mommy and the daddy. So their children would be out of the love. We have decimals, fractions, and percents. Now, just like any sibling, they're all related, but yet they're all unique. So they're expressing themselves in their unique forms. Now, we have different personalities, we have different likes, dislikes, uh, so on and so forth. So we're representing the same value, but in different form. So culturally, as Navajo children, we have four clans. So we can tie this in as your mother and your father, and these are the kids. Subtraction is very closely related to division. Addition is very closely related to multiplication. Okay, so throwing in the signs there. Now with these four operators, we want to understand how they're related to percents, fractions, and decimals. Culturally, these four siblings with the same two parents have four clans. Well, the mother's clan would be the first clan. Father's clan, the second clan. The maternal grandfather's clan would be addition and the paternal grandfather's claim would be subtraction. So now as we tie in Navajo culture with the mathematics, we can honestly say with these siblings, just like I said, they're all from the same family. They're unique in their own different ways. We're representing the same value in different ways, okay? Now if I were like, let's say for example, percents or decimals or fractions, and these were my clans, I would introduce myself as multiplication initially, Division Bushishchin, addition Dushiche, subtraction Dushinele. And so, yes, we can tie in Navajo culture with mathematics and to help our Navajo students understand the math and boosting their mathematical literacy. So, if you want to use this method, you can. So, again, that's how we have this math family and everybody's related. Thank you for listening.